Well, getting kids excited to learn about science and math can be a real challenge for some Without teachers. Without a doubt, but a local professor is using hip hop to make his class cool for students. Lisa Evers shows us how in this month's Big Idea. Let me tell you something. I want to get your attention. DNA has the genetic information. Something incredible is happening inside the Validus Prep Library. The energy is at a fever pitch for the performers. Not celebrities, but students who write verses to popular beats using the terminology of their science lessons. It's a nice spring day and then it storms. The temperature drops, then rain forms. They're part of the Hip Hop Ed Science Genius Program. It uses the rhythmic repetition of rap to help teens memorize scientific concepts. It's the brainchild of Dr. Christopher Emden, one of the top urban education experts in the country. We literally just go into the classroom and we say, who can rhyme? And literally, we'll, and we'll have 95, 96% of the kids say, oh, I can rhyme. And then I might go and just spit a science ball. And they're like, what just happened? The yellow for the last sequence. Students compete to represent their school in a battle rap science bowl competition. In hip hop, the kids are doing everything that you want them to be doing in school. And in school, they're completely disengaged. And we know, as an educator, I know that if a young person is engaged in the content that's going on in classroom, then they're more likely to be successful in the content. This is not some gimmick or time-filling entertainment. Dr. Emden, himself a product of New York City public schools, says hip-hop helped him, especially the science-oriented verses of Jizza from the Wu-Tang Clan, who's now a hip-hop ed supporter. Each drop was full of hip-hop energy, connecting on all sides with such great symmetry. The bars unlocked the power of the stars and turn a mirror in the telescope, pinpoint the guards. We put the science words on the board, put the definitions on the board so they know what it means, and we say, write four bars. You know, two lines that rhyme about the science content. And it starts there. Earth science teacher Tara Ware uses hip hop ed. She tells me it's a game changer in many ways, not the least of which is improved test scores. And not only do they take the vocab I give them, but then they try to research their own vocab. And they actually figure out vocab that I never taught them, which takes learning a step further. I'm gonna get an A if I see this on the region. Ware believes it's vastly enhanced her ability to connect with her students and makes teaching more fulfilling for her. Taking in time, taking in emotions, taking it just in passion. They want to be here if you ask them. They want to be doing this. And to get a kid that excited about education is something that I live for. I'm learning all this new information about rocks, metamorphic, sedimentary, calcite, was a, whatever it was. But it was some content in there, and I loved it. R to the O to the Z to the K. The biggest outcome is not just the work that we're doing. It's, the, the, it's what happens in their lives afterwards. So we have kids who are more engaged in science more likely to ask for advanced science classes. And now we have our group from the last four years who are going into college who are now declaring science majors in college. It helps me remember and use it in my vocabulary. It helped me and it helped everybody else that's here. The kids in the white schools and the kids in the African American schools and the kids in the Latino Latino schools are all consuming the same cultural artifact, which is hip hop. And so hip hop becomes the mechanism through which we can bridge the cultural and ethnic divides amongst these populations who've been segregated because of socioeconomic status. Yo, hip hop ed is the future. Like this idea of hip hop in education or as education, as an influencer of education, is the next frontier in not just hip hop, but in education. Um, we're changing the world. I love program go well beyond the classroom. The guidance counselor here told me that it helps so many of these students look at the potential for their lives in a whole new way. At Validus Prep in the South Bronx, I'm Lisa Evers, Fox 5 News.